the method they use is that of the Hegelian dialectic. Thesis played against antithesis leads to a synthesis. In other words, for Hegel, for history to make progress, you have to have conflict. And when you look at the key people in the order, you will find that they generate conflict. So Bush and Harriman politically are conflicting. Um, Coffin and Buckley, although part of the same order, are in public conflicting with one another because conflict leads to the new synthesis. One can only deduce at this point from the operations of these men as individuals and working together. Um, they want to acquire power above all. Power Political to do what? power. As you look at their actions, the political power is to bring about what they call a new world order, which is a one world. But they use the Hegelian techniques, and we know enough about Hegel to know that not only does this mean the dialectic process, the creation of conflict, but it also means that individuals such as you and I, or anybody watching this program, will be cogs in the state, that we have no individual rights, our rights for, rights for Hegel, individual rights for Hegel, come about through obedience to the state. Uh, we see it in the educational process, which we'll probably talk about later, that we have adopted what I call a Hegelian system of education, which is not to bring out your innate talents, but to prepare you to be an individual cog in the state.